If you have issues with Wi-Fi not working properly on Realme Note 70T, then here's what you can do in order to try to solve your issues. And we're going to start by going to Settings. Open Settings and then go to Connection and Sharing. Over here we can find the AirPlay mode and you want to make sure that it is disabled. Most of the time it is, but sometimes we can turn it on by accident and you might not be aware of that. So just make sure that it is off. After that, we can open Wi-Fi. And what you can do is you can, for example, uh, check if you have access to the same Wi-Fi network on other devices that also have Wi-Fi in order to see if the issue is actually on your smartphone's side rather than an issue with your Wi-Fi in general. Because if you don't have the Wi-Fi network available or if it's not working properly on other devices as well, then of course it means that you have issues with the Wi-Fi itself rather than Wi-Fi on your Realme. So uh, if the issue is actually just on your smartphone, then what you can do is you can uh, try to forget the network, you can remove it completely, and then try to reconnect to it. Of course, you will have to enter the password again and so on, um, but sometimes this refresh can do the work. You can also make sure that auto connect is enabled. For example, if you have issues with disconnecting from the network, then of course you can make sure that automatic connection is actually working over here. What you can also do, and um, something that I actually didn't mention uh, just yet, but I should have, is the Wi-Fi option itself. Sometimes you can just simply turn off and turn back on Wi-Fi. And from time to time, this simple thing can help you with the Wi-Fi not working properly. However, if that's not the case, what you can also do is you can go to the Wi-Fi assistant over here and you have several options that we can manage. For example, we have turn on Wi-Fi automatically, which turns uh, Wi-Fi, the smartphone turns Wi-Fi back on uh, when you are near high quality safe network, uh, like your home network. And so sometimes uh, this can be the reason why you have issues with the Wi-Fi, for example. So you can make sure that it is disabled. Um, in case you actually enable it, uh, enabled it before. There is also smart internet connection where you can use Wi-Fi and mobile data for apparently seamless uh, network experience. But uh, this can also be the reason why you have issues with Wi-Fi, for example, disconnecting or something. So you can uh, check if it's enabled and if it is, then of course you can turn it off. Now, besides that, what you can also do is go to the settings of Wi-Fi and that is in case you don't see your network over here in the list of saved networks. So for example if you want to remove the network but you cannot find it on this list then you can tap on these three dots in the top right corner and then open more settings and then you should be able to find saved networks so you can remove the network that you want to and get rid of. There's also Wi-Fi direct but I don't think that's actually and um, that might be the reason why you have issues with Wi-Fi so I think we can skip that. All right, so now I think I covered everything that we have in the Wi-Fi settings, but if none of this actually helped, there is one more thing that you can do. More precisely, uh, what we need to do is go to System and Update in Settings, and then go to Reset Phone. And over here we have Reset Network and Bluetooth Settings. And unfortunately, we will reset Wi-Fi, Bluetooth, and Mobile Network settings all at once, so we cannot separate it. This means that you will have to reconnect to your Bluetooth devices, for example, of course, your Wi-Fi networks as well, and so on. Um, but resetting these settings can help you solve issues with the Wi-Fi. So once you are done with this setting, if you decide to reset these settings, then of course you want to go back to the Wi-Fi and you want to reconnect to your network. And remember, like I said, to also go to Bluetooth and connect your Bluetooth devices again, and also check mobile network settings in case you changed something uh, to make sure that it is still uh, set up as it should be. And that's it. Thanks for watching. Leave a like and subscribe.